Good day to all of you. Today, next day neurosurgery, we are discussing about the information that you get from the doctor and how to build up the discussion the way you should get your treatment through a doctor. Uh, we have seen because of this information gap and communication errors, patients go to quacks. In Sri Lanka, there are different categories of doctors who are registered to practice their medicine like Western doctors, Sometimes there are registered doctors and uh, native doctors, Ayurvedic doctors, homeopathic and Chinese uh, doctors are there uh, registered to practice the uh, type of medicine they are practicing. There are doctors who practice certain types of medications and treatment methods which does not belong to any medical type. So these patients sometimes come to us and we see huge uh, problems in these patients due to wrong treatment modalities. Like there are some patients coming who has spine issues where the doctor uh, hammer the spine with a hammer, virtually using a hammer. And some doctors are there who tie the patients to a bench and ask them to walk. And there are certain uh, doctors who put their knee and press onto the spine and do various uh, unauthentic treatment methods and as a result if these things go right it's not come to the surface but patients come with severe neurological damage due to this kind of treatment therefore it's very important that you should discuss the treatment modality with your doctor whether it's a western doctor or some other doctor is immaterial you have to ask the questions whether you know, this is the correct treatment method and what is the disease that he is treating. And at the same time, at any point, whether it's a Western doctor or Ayurvedic doctor, the patient should have the right to say, no, I don't need this treatment. And anybody who is registered in this country is legally bound to listen to the patient and stop the treatment if the patient asks. You should understand this patient's right because we see with the advanced technology and diverse uh, mechanisms of treatment, patients are being victimized at certain places. Therefore, you should understand your right. You should build a good rapport with your doctor and continue tr your treatment. Then if you do that, there won't be any bad effect due to the treatment when you go to a doctor to take treatment.